Hillel was a great rabbi and scholar in Israel and the Romans. He led his students into the woods to study Torah in secret, but his students fought and were punished with death. After many years, the Romans caught and killed him. Hillel said, if I'm only for myself, if I'm not for myself, he will be free. If I am only for myself, what am I? If not now, what? I think this quote means that if I don't help myself, I can't expect anyone else to. And if I only help myself, I'm just selfish. If I don't find an equal balance now, I'm relaxed. This quote can be used to describe me when I'm being kind of dumb. I give him some of my levels, but then I lose some of mine. Um, but if I don't give him any, he'll be sad. So sharing is a way of having an even balance between the two. Albert Einstein was a famous scientist and mathematician. One of his most famous quotes was, not everything that, that counts can be counted, and everything that can be counted counts. I think this quote means that there are many things that count in your life that are physically important to you. There are also many things that can be counted, like onion rings. The big important things like, like care cannot be counted. And just because you can't count onion rings or paper clips, that doesn't mean they are important. It's like when my mom asked me what? It's like when I asked my mom why I got the least attention out of the whole family. She asked me why I thought that because you can't count attention. You can't say you gave me 365 attentions. In this, I learned that there are many things that that can count but aren't really the important things in your life. Attention is one of these things that count in my life. Another thing that counts in my life is care. But you can't and you can't count either in either one of them. But it is important to have it to have them and to be grateful for them.